But like I said, I am married, and my wife is so much smarter than I am. Like, my wife is a financial advisor with two master's degrees. I, on the other hand, once took a screenshot on my phone to show my friend the crack on it. <laughs> for a while, um, I, I'm still amazed at how husbands and wives can even live together. You know, because men and women are so different, aren't they? Like, one of the ways that men and women are so different is that women always compliment each other. You know, women will just go up to each other and say, Becky, I love that blouse. Is it new? <laughs> You men have this conversation. <laughs> You're not going to see this. Hey, Bruce. Your hair is absolutely stunning this evening. <laughs> and those shorts are adorable. <laughs> you know, the color of that shirt really makes your eyes pop. <laughs> now, why don't you tell Mountain Rice Petty where you bought it? <laughs> see that. Also, men and women have such different perspectives of what romance is. Because, like, I took my wife out for dinner to date night not too long ago, and we sat down and she looked right at me and she goes, Kyle, you really need to work on your romance. And I'm over there going like, honey, what are you talking about? Because <laughs> when she said that, it irritated me a little bit because I really do think that I'm romantic. And so it started this argument between us that got so loud that the manager at Taco Bell asked us to leave. <laughs> <laughs> and my wife is all into the five love languages. Are you guys familiar with the lo love languages? <laughs> so she comes up to me and she goes, well, Kyle, you know, sometimes you could just hold my hand because one of my love languages is physical touch. <laughs> so I did, I go, okay. So I reach out to grab her hand, she's like, not now! <laughs> I'm like, not now? What does your love language have, a calendar I should know about? I'm like, Do I need to make an appointment with your love language? Because she's always reminding me about what her love languages are. You know, she's like, Kyle, now remember, my love languages are physical touch and words of affirmation. So I gave her a high five and told her good game. <laughs> <laughs> but another big way that men and women are so different is that women are so observant and we aren't at all, right? For example, one way, one, one real stressful thing that women, that you do with your husbands is come out and say, so do you notice anything different? <laughs> because we don't. <laughs> we don't, we don't notice anything different. In fact, you could come out wearing nothing but cowboy boots and a stormtrooper helmet and <laughs> we'd be just like, so what's for dinner? <laughs> Because my wife is so observant. The other day I was getting dressed and I came out of the bedroom and she looked at me and she goes, Kyle, you wore that shirt two Fridays ago. <laughs> I was like, really? Because I didn't even know I had this shirt two Fridays ago. <laughs> and then she said, and are you wearing those underwear again? I'm like, no, I'm wearing them still. <laughs> Hey, did you know that Drybar Comedy has their own app? 
Download it right now so you can watch my whole special.